Hey everybody, JC here. It's another Main Engine Monday. So after the debacle of last week, we're going to go back to mini engine powered rockets that are not 3D printed. So hopefully this will uh, get us a little more altitude and possibly less crashing. Although, you know, as Kevin would say, if you're not crashing, you're not flying. All right, so the first up is the Pee Wee. It's a kit bash rocket. It's got uh, sky cruiser fins and a nose cone from the balsa part of an interceptor wing pod. So I just sort of threw it together from parts one day. It's going on a one half A34T, launching in five, four, three, two, one. Okay, there it is, right above us. All right. As I always say, close is good. Well, all the parts are still there, which is always important. All right. Okay, so next up is the Fire Streak SST. And I picked up this rocket specifically for Mini Engine Monday. So it's kind of an interesting looking rocket. It looks pretty fat, but it's got a BT5 tube going through the middle of a plastic casing and it snaps together. So hopefully nothing bad will happen and it won't blow apart in two million pieces. But you never know. Okay, this is going on to A34T, launching in five, four, three, two, one. Looks good, deployment. Oh, something just landed on the ground. Not sure what that was. Oh, I think it was the rocket. And that is just the streamer. So, yeah, bit of separation there. Or, well, complete separation. Not sure what happened, but oh, there's the rocket over there stuck in the ground. Okay, so that uh, doesn't bode well. Let's turn this off and Huh. Interesting. Oh. Oh, let's see where the nose cone is. You see the snap swivel is still shut. So I'm wondering if the nose cone plastic piece broke off. So we'll have to look around. Okay, so here's the streamer. And you can see that, where the camera is, there is, that's still closed also. So I have to assume that the plastic loop on the nose cone broke off. That's not encouraging because it's kind of a weird shape. So I'm not sure it would be replaceable. Oh, well, probably not going to find it in this grass either. Well, yeah, I'm not going to spend a lot of time looking for that. Okay. Okay, our final mini engine launch of the day is my dearly beloved Astron Sprite. Now, this rocket is the first one I ever built. It's the oldest rocket I have. It was made to fly on the Series 3 short motors, which they, of course they don't make anymore. So what I did was I cut off an 18 millimeter casing and stuck the mini engine inside of it. That way it's the same length, same width, etc. 
So I haven't launched this in several years. Hopefully all will go well. Having this damage to get lost would really bum me out. Okay. Launching in five, four, three. Oh, it's going on A34T. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so it landed over there, another, another ballistic entry into the ground. Now, it's supposed to tumble, but the motor tends to eject instead of staying in the rocket, which is, yeah, exactly what happened here. Okay. Luckily, just hit some soft ground. Got a little dirt on it. But, all right, another successful flight. Looks good. All right. Okay, so for today's bonus launch, we have the Venture. Now, the last time we saw the Venture, it was in pretty rough shape. It was part of the ABC Challenge. It had gotten crunched. I think someone stepped on it, but I'm not sure. But it's all repaired, ready to go. It's going on a B64. Launching in five, four, three, two, one. All right, there we go, good deployment. Right above my head. Oh, so painful. Oh, I have to turn around here. Oh, where is it? There it is, okay. There, good flight. Okay, there it is. Uh, nice wet grass. Everything looks good. Yep. All right, let's see if we got any info on the altimeter. Oh, looks like 457 feet. Pretty good. Hey everybody, so I was out picking up wadding. You know, I don't want to leave stuff on launch site. And as I was walking back to where I had placed all my stuff, look what I found. The nose cone for the fire streak. Which is good because it would have been hard to replace. So let's take a closer look at it. Uh, let's see here. Uh, hmm, not focusing very well, but there we go. Okay, so you'll notice it had a loop there that just snapped right off. Uh, so that's probably fixable. I'll have to look into that. Maybe I can put a, something else in there, a loop or something. Uh, I'll figure it out, but yeah, uh, it's unfortunate. But I'm just glad I found it. That way the rocket's uh, flyable again. Just have to make some mods to it. All right. Always helps to pick up your trash. <laughs>